city in the world. We got everything is here, right? Yeah. yeah. Got the best of fucking everything. Best art, culture, best food. Fucking food everywhere. You can buy food wherever you want on the street. Street food on the street is better than most restaurants in any other city. But yet there's still a hunger problem. In the city. We know it. It's all, it's right under our noses. People don't talk about it. You don't want to talk about it. But there's a population that's hungry. Of course, I'm referring to the female models that are walking around. They are so hungry, those girls. Jesus, just walking around just all fast, just with their long torsos and necks like fucking sexy giraffes. Just like that. Yeah. Where are they getting a sandwich? They're not going to get a sandwich. They can't eat sandwiches. I wish they'd go get sandwiches. And people think that models are kind of unapproachable and snobby and pretentious. No, they're just really hungry. They get grumpy. When I haven't eaten for an hour, I'm the worst. People ask me a question, what? I need chips. And then I eat chips. And then I'm better. They can't eat chips. Some of them don't eat for six days. It's terrible. <laughs> Sometimes I like to go to Madison Square Park area, like near the Flatiron, because one of my friends said that that's where all the castings are for the models. So there's like, if you go in the middle of the day, there's thousands of them walking around, just all like, and I like to stand on a corner and pretend that they're all walking toward me. And that instead of in their portfolios, instead of pictures and photographs of themselves, it's a dossier of reasons why they want to date me. I just walk up like, hello, my name is Nirvana, Adam, hello, these are the reasons why we'd be a good match. You are a mildly successful actor comedian for the last 12 years. You have crippling credit card debt. You have average looks and you don't get money. <laughs> Let's go have sex in my $10,000 a month penthouse. Follow me. <laughs> See, that's what... <laughs> oh, shit. It's fine. It's like... Hard dating. I mean, I, I just moved here from the West Coast, and like, I grew up in Boston. Like, dating girl, like, there's no real difference. It's hard, kind of, anywhere you go. People are like, are there, is there differences between the dating scene? No, I mean, you know, I'm just happy now. I'm a little bit older. I'm in my mid 30s, so I can start dating older women, like, 26. <laughs> <laughs> because like, because that's like that's the age where the, you because you get rid of the early to mids. The early to mids fucking suck. I mean, I we had to deal with them for a while because the early to mids, no matter what part of the country you are, they're just they, they're these girls. Like, wait, what are we doing? <laughs> Seriously, oh my god, it's so funny, and there's, there's a lot of it. <laughs> Where's the next party? This party sucked. We're at it. Let's just keep going. And you're like, oh, it's fucking. And the only difference in, in like LA is it's the same, but just with different words. It's just like, oh my god, because I have an audition tomorrow. My manager, I have a new manager. She thinks that I would be good at comedy. They're like, I think I'm pretty funny. They're like, it's fine. Like, it's dramatic. I'm like, okay, I can do comedy. And it's cool because I'm getting your picture, so I'm not going to drink next to one. But And here, here, which is it's the same shit, but just like, I'm in finance and like, I'm in demolish. Oh, 